What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, this is Virgin Graphics. In today's video, guys, I'll be explaining to you what an invoice is and um, how to send invoice as a pro. All right, as a pro. I'm not the pro actually. All of us, we are all learning. All right. So if you if you don't miss out on my video, please, guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like this video, and share. All right. So actually, concerning the last video I put up, some of you asked me questions on why, um, what is invoice, and how to create invoice. All right. So what I'm going to do is, I'll, okay, before we do that, let me tell you what invoice is. Invoice is actually a list of goods sent, um, sent or service provided. Like, um, if your client contacts you and um, asks you for a service, all right. So you're going to you're going to use your invoice to list the service you provide and how much it's going to cost. So that invoice actually represents you out there between you and your. It's just like a communication between you and your customer in terms of bills. You understand in terms of price and charges all right so actually um if you come back to my core draw uh, i'm not going to explain to you how i created this actually i've made the template for you guys so this is a template but this is not the color which i use i just made a, a template like a color um you can actually um edit it i'm going to make it editable for you guys so you're going to make use of it so i'm going to put the link where you're going to download this soft copy a core draw soft copy so i'm going to step it down to core 17 core draw 17 well, for the sake of those who don't have Core 17, I'm going to put a PDF version and a Core Draw version. All right. So if you if you don't have this version, um, Core Draw 17, but I believe you should have it. All right, Core Draw 17. So if you don't have it, if you're using lower version, you can actually use the um, PDF to import to your Core Draw and edit it. All right. So actually, uh, I'm not going to like show you guys how we created this, but I'm going to put it for you guys to be making use of. All right, so you can actually use it to communicate with your clients. So actually, if you come over to this place, this is my uh, my name, or right, Jim Graphics, and this is my number, and this is my face. Actually, I'm using my face as a logo. All right, I, I don't I don't actually have a specific logo for my brand, so I use my face. So I honestly sometimes I don't know if it happens to you guys like me. If I design, uh, if I have my own personal design, I don't feel okay with it. Like until somebody. Or another graphic designer helped me to do it like I don't feel okay like I'm not satisfied with my work in terms of if I'm the one doing it like if I'm doing my own personal work I'm not satisfied with it all right so unless somebody do it but I I kind of found it um, okay working for other people you understand so actually I made this template for you guys so this is the template I use my personal template all right so if you come over to this place you can actually select and edit you can say okay uh, Nike graphics all right so maybe you can just change your name all right so here is gym graphics so this is my template all right you can leave this as invoice you can come over to this place okay um number of invoice sent you can start your own as 001 all right maybe all right so um okay the date invoice date issued um payment due all right you can just make the dates all right then this is the amount due all right this is where you're going to put the total amount and the total amount you're going to put here is actually the total amount that is going to be summed here all right so this way you're going to list your um products all right what you're going to be doing like this one is the stage banner how many was the size 10 by 10 feet that's the size all right quantity you put one all right price all right you can basically put the price all right you understand delivery you can actually um put the delivery fee if you charge for delivery i personally charge for delivery all right i charge for delivery all right so actually over here you can see payment below fifty thousand. i collect full payment if your if your job is below 50k like if it's fifty thousand, all right like um let's say twenty thousand, you don't actually pay me um half payment i take full payment so if you're not okay with that all right that's fine by you so um actually Payment above hundred thousand, I take ninety percent. Um, some take ninety nine percent actually, but I take ninety percent payment and ten percent to be balanced after production. All right. So actually, um, once I deliver your job, you pay me the remaining ten percent. All right. So th that is actually it. Sorry guys, I'm fast about it because I'm actually in a hurry to do something. So actually, this is um the invoice. So I'm going to put the template editable one. So once you come over to this place, please. Don't use my logo okay i'm going to remove it actually let me remove it so i'm going to say um your logo here i'm going to type logo here all right so just place your logo over there and um basically um make use of it you understand so 
over here we have the contact so you can put your contact like um plus two three four zero eight zero uh, okay that's my number all right so basically you can just edit this one and um, that is it so if you come over to this we have the total sum the total sum is what you're going to put on the amount due and also over here all right so that is actually an invoice so once you're done with it you can actually come to your file and um, select publish as pdf you understand then select where you want to save it then you can say um put it as the customer or the company's name so once you do that maybe you can say gym um invoice all right just save it save come to save as type all right select pdf all right so already is on pdf so you can select desktop so you can click on save and once you do that it's saved so you come over to um your desktop where i saved it or you can go to wherever you saved it all right so once you go to the place and locate it you can basically just drag and send to your customer all right just go to your whatsapp and send to your customer and then um actually that's when you're going to um your customer going to see the price um of what he's paying for all right then you have your communication and make your agreement and come to conclusion and then you can execute your um your your stuff right so actually that is it guys so if you don't want to miss out on my next video guys i'm putting out something unique for you guys very unique don't forget subscribe share invite your friends to this channel and basically guys see you guys in my next video